These eggs are washed, yet they're not in my fridge. Why? We're gonna roll down to the farm, show y'all something real quick. All right, so check this out. These are the eggs that go to you fine people. When you grab this egg right out of the nest box, it's got a natural coating on it called a bloom. You can't see it, but if you were to come out here early, while these noisy girls were still in here laying these eggs, when they first come out, they look a little moist. They've got like a like a little sweat to them almost. They're, and it quickly dries off, like within seconds. But that is the setting of the bloom. It's a natural protectant that keeps bacteria and other bad stuff out of the egg. Now, important to note, those aren't the eggs that I eat because those eggs are at a premium. It's time for me to move this thing from here to here. So I want to show you uh, why it is that I wash my eggs particularly. Just as a fun kind of side note, as I close these things up here to get ready to move them, see what this girl right here is doing? That is dust bathing. And that is why it's so important to have these guys out in pasture, out in a natural, natural environment, because what they're doing is they're getting mites and lice and worms and stuff off of them. They're also kind of deworming. They're eating a little bit of that dust and it keeps parasites off of them and out of them. In a confinement environment where they're in battery cages in a, in a hen house, that, uh, that effect would have to be achieved through medication in the feed. So it's just one more way that we keep our products all natural. You can also see they're starting to go through their molt, which is why their egg production is down a little bit. Okay, so now I've moved it forward in their enclosure. Now let's take a look at where they've been. So over here is where the henmobile just was. This was just sitting on top of that. And you're gonna notice some of the eggs that they've laid right here on the ground. These dirty ones, like these, so we're gonna take these filthy McNasties home. So naturally, we're gonna wash the dirt off of this. First thing we're gonna do is get them wet, let them soak for a bit. And so there they are, nice and clean and pretty. Now, even though I've washed these, I'm probably not gonna put them in the fridge. Why is that? It's because of how fresh they are. These were just laid in the last 24 hours and eggs are good for a surprisingly long time, even if the bloom has been washed off. If I were to put them in the refrigerator, the quality would be better for longer. The whites would stay tighter. The yolks would sit higher for a longer time. But again, all these eggs are gonna be gone within the next three or four days because we're making pancakes. We might be breaking bread later. And I eat just three to four eggs a day just between frying them, scrambling them, and just using them in general so these are going to be gone but for our customers we will wash these to get the pathogens off the outside and then we refrigerate them to preserve the quality for the most part not necessarily to keep them from going bad for longer supply chains in the United States, where your eggs might be going from the eastern shore of Maryland all the way to California, then it becomes an issue of shelf life. So if you've got an egg that's been washed or unwashed, it's just going to last a lot longer if it's been refrigerated and it's kept in a cold chain. So there you go. Everything you didn't want to know about eggs and wait for the fight to start in the comments. I'm, I'm going to go bake something now.